Hello, and today in this Article Forge review and demo, I want to show you how you can use Article Forge to easily create high quality content uh, for many different purposes, but especially if you're trying to build a blog. So, uh, welcome to my channel, Online Verb. Please take a look around. This is a channel where I share different ways to make money online, and I also review different um, program software that I use that help me and that I think would help you as well. And so one of those programs um, or automated softwares that I've been using recently is called Article Forge. And this is an AI powered, so artificial intelligence powered uh, content creator. And the really nice thing that I like about Article Forge compared to many other AI content creators is that it can write a 1500 word article automatically. Okay, and I'm going to show you that in just a second. Um, and so it's really, really simple to use. Um, a lot of AI content, you have to, you know, give it a little um, tease, you know, the keyword or the concept, um, and then it'll write, and then you got to, you know, give it another hint, and then it'll write some more. And so it really can take quite a bit of work to get the article that you want. Um, but article... Forge does that for you. And if you go to their website here on their home page, they have some different uh, uh, article examples that you can read. So this is a um, SEO article, and you can read through that. And the main keyword they used was how to create an SEO strategy, and it's about 1,500 words long. But you can use this in any niche, okay? So here's an entertainment article talking about um, video game. I'm not really familiar with this, but you can read through it. Um, a local article, like what to do in New York City. So if you have a travel blog, um, a health article, just the general tips to improve your physical fitness. And then here's an example, they have an example on finance. So you can use it for really almost anything. Okay, super easy. And um, it really is this simple. I mean, a lot of times you see these one, two, three things, but Article Forge really is this simple. You just enter your keyword, how long you want your article to be. There's a few other customizations that we'll look at in a second. And then wait 60 seconds, and boom, it'll produce that content. Now, this is a little bit of, you know, <laughs> 60 seconds. If you're doing a very short article, yes, it probably will spit it out in 60 seconds. If you're doing a 1,500-word article, it takes about five or six minutes, which is still very, very quick for that length of an article. And then you have the article, and you can, um, you know, uh, download it in HTML form. If you're uh, just adding it to your blog, you can download it in text or PDF file as well. And so let's go ahead and just log in. The other nice thing about Article Forge is it, it the content is completely unique. It always passes CopyScape, so you don't have to worry about uh, duplicate content issues. And so here we are. It's a very simple um, members area. You can just here click here to create a new article. It stores all your articles. So there in this section, you can connect your WordPress blogs, and that's the other beautiful thing about Article Forge is you can actually Schedule posts here. So once you have your WordPress blog connected to Article Forge, you can go into the post scheduler and you can enter a list of keywords and you can say you want how many articles you want, how how many days apart. So you can say I want one article every day and you upload 90 keywords. So therefore, Article Forge would automatically create one new article and post it to your WordPress blog every day for 90 days using each of those 90 keywords. So it's actually very cool. Now I don't do this, I do it just manually because that's just the way I prefer to do it right now, but you certainly could do that. Um, it does have an API, so it'll integrate with uh, several different WordPress plugins that are out there or other site builders that use their API. Um, and then they have a help center for you as well. So let's just go through an example here in creating a new article, let's say, our topic is, um, well, actually, let's do this. I'm going to put this on pause for a second, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I want to grab this. This is um, a list of keywords for a new uh, dog site that I'm building. And you can see I create, you know, the date I created these articles for these keywords in Article Forge. And you can see I'm easily cranking out several articles a day, and I could really do more if I wanted to. Um, but I usually just try to make two or three or four articles a day in Article Forge because it's very quick. And once I set it up, I just let it run while I'm doing something else in the background. So let's, uh, since I'm doing these, let's go ahead and make an article here. So what are short hair dog breeds? So let me take that keyword, 
So let's go here. We're back in Article Forge. In the Create a New Article, I'm going to paste that keyword here. What are the short hair dog breeds? Um, and then you can you know, use different languages to choose from. And then you decide how long you want your article. Okay, so for my blog, I usually do between 750 or 1500, depending on how much information I think Article Forge can grab for that keyword. So I'm going to say we'll do 750 words for this one. Now, I let it go ahead and add titles, add section headings, and auto generate section headings for me. And then I like to have it add an image and add a video. And then you can see these are your other options down here. Or if you want, you can have it automatically post to your WordPress blog if it is integrated with your Article Forge account. So let's see what time it is. It is 5.46 p.m. And let's go ahead, let's actually go back. Um, and we're going to say we started this at, just so we can keep track, 5.46 p.m. Okay. So let's go back into Article Forge. Let's go ahead and create the article. And so it is doing that. And so while it's doing that, uh, I'm going to go ahead and just pause the video and then we'll come back once that article is done and we'll see how it looks and we'll see um, how long it took. And actually, before I pause the video, I just want to talk to you about different ways that you can use Article Forge. So one of the ways that, you know, obviously makes the most sense is you can use it for your WordPress blogs. And so maybe you have a blog about health, about yoga, about pets, about whatever. You could really almost any topic. It could be a travel. Um, you know, you could make a travel blog and you could have articles about, let's say, you love going to Savannah, Georgia. And so you have articles um, for different cities that, you know, across the country about, you know, top five things to do in Savannah, Georgia, best places to eat in Savannah, Georgia, best tourist attractions in Savannah, Georgia. And so do you see what I'm saying? You can also go um, and use a, um, let me go to Google here. And there is actually a really helpful website that you can use called Answer the Public uh, to get keywords. And so you can go here and you can, they have a free account and they have um, a pro, but we'll just say, and so you could just say, um, well, let's just say Savannah, Georgia. Okay, and what this is going to do is it's going to find the top keywords that people are asking for about Savannah, Georgia, and, and you know, questions. And so the questions make up great keywords. And so then you can take these keywords that Answer the Public comes up with, and you can use those as the keywords for your content in Article Forge. Okay, so it's still working away over here. So let's go back. Um, so it came up with 68 questions about Savannah, Georgia. Now you can look at it in this visualization. This is trying to say, you know, Savannah, Georgia with the preface can, are, why, etc. And then I think these are supposed to represent most common to maybe least common questions. And you can see it has lots of these. Um, so these are 49 prepositions, 37 comparisons, etc. So, uh, or you can come up here and you can say I want all of this in a data form. And if you go to the top up here, <clears throat> you see you can download all of these into a CSV and then add those to a, a spreadsheet to uh, come up with your keywords that you're going to use for your articles in Article Forge. Okay, this is still working. Um, when I'm doing the screen recording, it always seems to take a little longer, but that's okay. So, but these are ways that you could get you know, ideas, you know, because that's one thing I always have a hard time with, right? I don't like writing, number one. I'm not very good at it. It takes time. And so something like Article Forge makes it super easy to create really good content, upload it to my sites, maybe edit it a little bit, and it makes it super easy. And then answer the public, you know, then I'm always like, okay, so what do I, I got, I got my niche. Now what am I going to write about? Well, you go to answer the public and you can see, you know, some really great keywords um, that you can use to get. Uh, topics. And so then you just take, use those and put them in. And if you want to connect Article Forge to your WordPress site, then you can actually schedule posts to go out automatically. And that is a way to really make your uh, content creation super, super easy. All right, so we're almost done with this article, but let me just go and put the um, video on pause while it finishes up. Okay, so you can see it's done. Click here to see the result. 
the time is 5.51 p.m. Okay, so we started at 5.46. So, yeah, it took five minutes to create this 750-word article. Let's see what it looks like. So here we go. What are the short-haired dog breeds? Um, it didn't add an image. Sometimes it doesn't do that if, the, if it's too vague, but I can add an image very simple. And so here you go. It's going to talk about Basset Hounds, German Pincher, Wire Fox Terrier, Labrador Retriever, Chihuahua, and then it added a video at the bottom. And so if you go through and read it, you can see that's very good uh, content. Whether you're looking for a small or large dog, there are plenty of breeds with short hair. If you're looking for a dog that is easy to care for, you'll want to find one with short hair. These breeds are typically very easy to train to, uh, very easy to train to, and great for people. I can't see that. It's uh, familiar with dog grooming. Read on discover more about some of the most popular short hair breeds. So you can see it reads really, really well, right? So I am going to go ahead and you know save that. Um, but then you can export it as a text file if you want, export it as HTML, export it as a PDF, or post it to your WordPress site if your site is connected to Article Forge. Now, you could also, you know, use Article Forge. Let's say maybe you want to do some freelance writing, you know, and offer article uh, or content. You could, you know, put your um, self out on these different freelance sites like Fiverr, etc., and say you'll write, you know, 750 word article, 1500 word article for $10, you know, um, which is very reasonable. That's actually pretty cheap. Um, a lot of times you can get away with really charging 20 or $30. And so that, you know, that would pay for your, your uh, subscription to Article Forge right there. So lots of different ways that you can use this. You could even use this to create book, you know, a book. Say you have a, you want to write a book about a certain topic, and so you have Article Forge, you know, maybe use different keywords for the chapters, and then you have Article Forge create the content, you put the book together, you upload it to Amazon Kindle or one of the online bookstores, and there you go. So lots of different ways you can use Article Forge. I hope you found this video helpful. If so, uh, please like the video, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe so you can get more content as it comes out. Thanks so much for watching.